let's pick up where we left off. We are working on the scales on the bottom of the tail. So this is pretty much going to be the same thing, but I'm going to show some of it. Um, so anyway, we want to get in here with the elastic deform tool and we want to pull these scales together, square them off just a little bit. You don't have to go really far with them, but you just want them to have a little bit more definition. The elastic deforms really nice for stuff like this. It grabs the surrounding area and pulls everything together, which I really like. That should be good enough for those. And then all we're going to do, it's the same thing. This one is essentially going to end up overlapping this one. So we're just going to pull this out more at the bottom and then just kind of feather that in. And then, like I said, you can go through just smooth things out a little bit to get rid of the lumpiness on them. Just like that. Now I'm going to carry it down the rest of the way on the tail. I'll be back in just a minute. So here we are with the rest of the scales going down the tail finished. Or I should say at least finished up to this point. So I think that looks pretty good. I'm still not sure what I'm going to do at the end of the tail. I thought about putting some spikes back there, even though most of the time he doesn't have that. The face, I guess, is an area. The chest I'm not going to do a whole lot with because the shape is pretty much there. Um, that just needs to be fine textured. I do think still have a little bit more work to do on the back. We definitely have a lot more work to do on the spikes. Um, but we'll take a look in the next video. We'll see what we're going to work on next. If you like these videos, please like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.